Hey, what about your brekkie? Oh, I'll grab some at work. Love, please don't rush off. Running late, sorry. Harry? Are you off your rocker, Bill? Just left. It's all right, we waited outside till everyone had gone. We? What do you mean, we? Harry. I'm so sorry. I never meant to put this kind of pressure on you. I, I wasn't trying to trick you into taking him. Then why didn't you tell me what you had planned the first time I saw you? Because I wasn't planning it. Oh. Okay, look, the thought crossed my mind, but it wasn't until Ollie was actually gone that I realised I could cope if, if I had to. If we had to leave him with you. I'm sorry, Kirsty. I don't know how you can even consider leaving him. I mean, two weeks is one thing, but two months is a whole different story. Irene, this is not something that I want to do. We've been talking and arguing about this since the day Oliver was born. This isn't a spur-of-the-moment decision, are we? No, but it's a decision that is going to stay with you for the rest of your lives, and more importantly, it's going to stay with Oliver. I love Oliver very much, and I'm trying not to be selfish. I said to Cain, and I'm saying it to you, the very best thing that you can do for Oliver is to find somewhere to settle down and raise him. Yeah, I told you that is just impossible. Irene, we can't use their ID. So we can't even use bank accounts, we can't use credit cards, we can't even use our driver's licence. The only thing that we can do is get a cash-in-hand job where there's no questions asked. All the more reason for you to end this now. Hand yourselves in. Cut your losses. God save us. If he won't listen to sense, you have to. Kane says that you wouldn't agree to take Ollie unless you heard it from me, in person. So here I am, and I'm asking you, Irene, please, please, just look after him for us. I need time to think about this. I, I just don't know what the right thing to do Irene, is. Irene, we're already taking a huge risk by coming back here. Please don't make this any harder for us. Look, I know better than anyone how important it is that we sort this, but I will not be bullied into making the wrong okay, decision. I'm sorry, Irene, no, I wasn't no, to... no. I am going upstairs. I'm having a shower. I'm getting changed. I need time by myself to think about this. He's exhausted. He drove all night. So, um, have you made a decision yet? I'm sorry, love. I can't take him. Look, I know that if you give Oliver to me, I know with every bone in my body that you are going to live to regret it. Kirsty, love, they're only young once. You can never get those years back. Irene, don't you think that I know that? We can't, can't you see how hard I'm trying here to do the right thing? Yes, I can, and that's the problem. Love, Oliver is not a neglected child. He's not abused. He's not unloved or unwanted. And for that reason, he has to stay with you. He can't come with me. Look, I'm sorry if I'm sounding harsh, but I want it to sink in, Kirsty. How are you going to feel in ten years' time when you have missed everything? It's not like we'll never see him. What? So, what, you think you're just going to drift in and out of his life for the next umpteen years, is that it? Well, we can. We can do that. Why not? I'm, um, I'm going to go to the hospital now and visit him. Uh, you want to come? I can't do that. No, of course you can't. Green, it'll upset him if I come out of nowhere and then I just disappear again. Right. <clears throat> he can't stay there. Bill will be home in a couple of hours. Irene, you do understand why I can't come with you, don't you? You think you're just going to be able to swan the in and out of Ollie's life for the next I don't know how long and you can't even come to the hospital with me now for a couple of minutes to visit him. You are kidding yourself. You've got rocks in your head, Kirsty. Visitor, look how lively you are since Irene's been here, hey? Mm -hmm. oh, you're a good boy, aren't you? That's a giraffe. <laughs> um, lover, I won't be a tick. 
Chrissy, what do you think you're doing? Don't be so loud. You, you can't stay away, can you? But when you're here, you can't even say hello to your son. You can't give him a hug. I just want to see him, OK? I didn't want to upset him. Be honest. Who's going to be traumatised here, eh? Is it Ollie or is it you? somewhere to base yourself. This French fast behaviour is driving me around my flippin' twist. Yeah, we will, we will. It's just some dead on my feet. Do you reckon I could catch a bit of sleep in a proper yeah, bed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go use my bed. I'll, I'll wake you before the kids come home. <sighs> so, does he know you're at the hospital? Something else he doesn't know either yet, Irene. <sighs> You're right. I've decided to stop running. I just can't live like this anymore. <laughs> 